What's up guys, Tegab here. welcome back to another video, I hope you guys are feeling well and today I'm gonna show you guys a very simple trick on how you can actually fix the Fortnite game on your jailbroken device. So as you can see this is what happens when you try to launch it on a jailbroken device and of course this game will crash and the reason for it is because it actually has a jailbreak detection in it so it is predefined by the developer. So as you can see just in a few seconds, boom, it is crashing. So I'm gonna show you guys a very simple trick on how you can fix that and let's begin. But before we to start our today's sponsor is the AnyTrans from iMobby. This is basically an iTunes replacement which is faster and easier to use than a regular iTunes. So it allows you to transfer files not only from the iPhones and iPad but also Android devices. Make sure you check it out in the link below. And okay guys, so the first thing what you want to do is just go ahead and launch Syria on your device and then go into the search and type in the files and manager. So files has finally been updated to support the latest iOS 11 jailbreak. So now click install and this will actually install the files on your device. Now it will look something like this. So click on this one and now go back uh, into your root folder. So it should be just the slash and that's it. So once you're here, just go ahead and click on this edit button, then select the bin folder, this one, and now click on the rename. Now we'll, we'll actually rename this one to the bin one uh, so now the actual Fortnite game will not be able to detect our jailbreak on this device so check this out now we will actually launch the uh, Fortnite on here so it will take a while so let's see if this will actually bypass this jailbreak detection so just make sure that it's fully loaded and you are on this screen now we can actually go back into the files and now rename back this folder that we have up here just because if you will leave this folder it was the new name and this the whole jailbreak will not start once you restart your device so just make sure that it's renamed back to the bin now i <laughs> want this point we can now launch the fortnite again and we can play the game uh with the jailbreak enabled on our device but yeah guys i think that should be pretty much it for this video i think everyone will be able to do such a procedure on their device to make this game run on their devices with the jailbreak and yeah guys if you found this useful definitely be sure to smack the like button that will be super much appreciated like always and as always guys i really Hope to see you around on my next one and peace out.